Hi guys, welcome to another episode. Episode number 47 of the Sputnik Challenge for Workers and Resources uh, Soviet Republic. Uh, look, we are pretty close to winter. But also, we are getting all our steel delivered right before winter. And I'm very glad uh, about it, because what, what here the mechanical components are, are coming. And we have a lot of people working here. So, uh, four cranes. I'm hoping we can... Uh, Fix it. There are two phases, uh, if I can see the last phase being steel and electro components. So yeah, we are we're waiting for that. Um, so what, what are we going to do today? Well, I, I just want to uh, monitor the build. Do we have... Oh, we didn't buy vehicles here. Let's do that quickly. Oh, we did. But you are not arrived. Where are you? Oh, you are getting fuel. Okay, that's that's fine. So, getting prepared for winter. Excellent. Hopefully, we finally can get some clean roads next next to our clean uh, clean air initiative kind of thing. Um, I wanted to. Uh, oh, just press play. Don't don't press fast forward. Um, so this is going to take a while because um, people probably. Uh, our uh, electric wiring is, is, is being built so that we can uh, get some fuel again because uh, the, all, our, all our fuel uh, oil stuff is uh, doing nothing. So uh, today what I wanted to do is, uh, well, obviously go through the comments. Um, and yeah, we, we are actually needing to wait until this is done, which is uh, pretty fast actually if i see how fast this is going we can even provide maybe the steel and the electrical components before winter could that happen i don't know i don't know but we have we have enough steel yes so go guys oh yeah i know what's happening now uh, now the game does it so that not these guys get the assignment But you, who, who is all the way here, or, well, that's not all the way, but you maybe all the way, all the way there, gets the assignment to get steel. That's, that's not really handy uh, when I have these sitting right next here. Yeah, that's not, not, not really helpful, actually, to get there before winter. Anyway, um... What I wanted to do, because in uh, January we, we, we need to assign, um, how do you say this? Assign our uh, extra workers again, or buy extra workers, whatever we want to call it. So I wanted to uh, build all three so that, that we're done. And maybe we can even add some uh, apartments here. It, it depends on, on how our shop is going, because, uh, well, it's, it's 50%. Because of our loyalty now and our productivity, it's gone up uh, uh, quite a bit all. In the last, uh, it's from 80% to 105%, that's a big difference. Still the police station is doing, and you can see in the number of, uh, in the percentage that's going down, that we are still uh, solving cases. Well, actually the fact that there are no cases here kind of gave that away. Um, so yeah. Um, I think we're done for, we are pretty much prepared for winter. Oh, winter. Yeah, excellent. Well, if we weren't, <laughs> I was a, a bit late. So what, what, what do I want to do? I want to talk to you about building our own ships. And uh, we are going to do that in Rotterdam here. So at some point we are going to have to flatten this, uh, this area. I'm going to make a time lapse out of that. And uh, I also want to kind of skip winter a bit this time because, well, hmm, I'm starting to dislike the whiteness for months more and more a bit. And also, if we plan our harbor, we can have these uh, these guys do stuff in the winter. So uh, what I want to do is start a time lapse and do my favorite thing in the world, which is uh, digging uh, and and flatten this area. I don't know if it's way too big. Uh, for what we're planning, but let's call this the end of uh, the Dutch, uh, I don't know, 
flatness and then we, we can here we can kind of go with the terrain a little bit more well amsterdam is going to be here i don't know what we're going to do uh, this i'm going to keep probably oh yeah what, what i want to say and here is going wait wait a minute let's just um we can go underground and then we can see the names of the cities pretty well so i want to remove you uh go away you have to be Rotterdam. Yes, excellent. So, and then Amsterdam, probably a bit here. Uh, here. Yes, uh, name an area. Here. Oh, you're, you're already starting with an A. That's fine. Amsterdam, rename. Amsterdam. Okay. Then you can go away. Go away. And you can go away. Go away. And you can go away. I, I hope this is possible here. Ah, well, well, well. Please go away. No. Too far away. Okay, okay, okay. And then uh, the idea was because we are our coal, I think it was somewhere here where we had coal. And our, uh, how do you say this? Um, Iron was somewhere here. So I want to call this area an um, Um because that's where the Dutch hoge ovens are. And uh, um, let me, let me, let me Wikipedia that. Um, the Koninklijke hoge ovens. What literally translate as Royal High Ovens. Uh, known as uh, Koninklijke Nederlandse hoge ovens en staalfabrieken. Um, until 1996 or in Formerly it's called Hoge Ovens, was a Dutch steel producer founded in 1918. Since 2010, the plant is named Data Steel Eimuiden. No, the plant is not named Data Steel. It, th 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 there was probably a takeover or something. Data Steel owns the company. Uh, so it's actually Indian owned. Okay, I didn't know that. Anyway, the Eimuiden Steel Works, based in Eimuiden, uh, Netherlands was built between 1920 and 1940, first producing iron, later steel, with hot and cold rolling producing flat products. In the 1960s, the company diversified into aluminum production. production. So that's why we are calling this area Eimuiden. Um So where, where is Amsterdam now? Somewhere here. So I hopefully if I place Eimuiden somewhere here. We will, have, we will have to look if we can uh, name the uh, name the iron where the iron ore plant is going to be also an iron. Let's call you an iron. Okay. And let's see if I can remove you now. Oh no. Remove you. Sorry. Wrong button. No. Still not. Okay. Then this is what it is. Okay. Um, I don't. I don't know where oil would be. In our country, actually. Um, so, what I want to do is first, uh, let's just play. Oh, yeah. First, go over the comments. And then uh, I'm going to start uh, digging here. Okay. Um, let me go to the comments first. And I'm always uh, sorting by date and then the oldest first. So, um, Kuba said uh, at 24 minutes crossing the canal uh, perpendicularly. About the, oh, now we can see the. Um, we should have frozen rivers actually, and then have a ice crusher go through it actually. Anyway, um, Kuba said uh, crossing the canal perpendicularly uh, to, to it is the way that you have cables hanging highest due to reduced length between poles because wires require some room to expand contract with temperature. Do they actually hang lower? Uh, in summer when it's 35 degrees yeah, yeah yeah i could have kind of put this a little bit closer and this a little bit closer and really perpendicularly would be like so or something but i i wanted to have some room for our embankments which is what kuba's next uh, comment is about um oh no sorry i'm um confusing here uh that was ethan excuse me uh kuba said at 43 minutes i know the plan is to make this plant far enough 
from the city. And now he's talking about the heating plant. But, uh, oh, switching back. Uh, but it may be smarter to wait for replacement power plant to finish and assessment of pollution affecting the city first before jumping the gun with the next heating plant. Yes, I, uh, I forgot to mention that uh, because that was the plan. And also I'm not building a heating plant in winter. It looks cleaner, the road, actually. Um, so we are going to power, power this up. No, not yet. Not yet. Almost. Electrical components. We're waiting for electrical components. Okay. Um, I want to see how the how the power uh, how the power plant how, how this affects our pollution here uh, and our people dying or not. Hopefully not. And and in summer I want to see if we can build this power plant when necessary. Also I want to wait be, before I want to plant the city of Amsterdam here. And then I also know where the power. Uh, how do you say this? Uh, the the heat exchanger are going to go, and I also want to do is, uh, it in summer because this uh, small heat exchanger, which is way over its capacity, actually. So uh, and obviously maybe it's not necessary at all, and we are just uh, uh, planning this for the city of Amsterdam, which in that case would be something like here or something somewhere closer, and then well have two, two he heating plants but somewhere here sounds fun so um, the infrastructure I will probably keep also so this can be powered so yeah thank you okay next one um, Ethan says Kaya before you upgrade all those tiny road segments you can you could instead try giving priority right of way to the main road with the priority road signs there even is a tool for quick assignment of these priority signs and inter to intersect. Well, I, I had to look that up how that works because now I'm always clicking and then switching the priority. But uh, there's a there's a better way, um, which is here. And there's this tool uh, here, press crossroads with priority roads. So you can kind of switch it. And so now this makes sense. And here, uh, well, this is wrong now and so we can kind of switch this around like so that the parameter is like this instead of this so it's very easy to assign where the priorities are and I'm definitely going to use that more I didn't know that was there thank you Ethan um, and also uh, he says I don't think ships care about wires but if you don't like them flipping into each other you can replace the power lines with cables you can get the full 19 megawatt by sp splitting out the power lines which is a with a high voltage switch into two cables and then joining them back up with a another high voltage switch that's that's a good idea i didn't know that was possible so that would in in a, a sense mean i can have like a, a switch here i'm i'm not going to build it here but it's just to to see if i get it right like a, a switch here uh, yeah, and a switch like here, somewhere like so. Go, and then have uh, two of these lines go there and go there. And now I can have my above whole wires continue like this, continue like this. Am I getting that correct? That these now are. 18 megawatt uh, the capacity of the wires well, how, how much do i get here yeah it's 12. so um um i hope i'm 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 getting this correct because then i'm i would definitely consider doing this and <laughs> making these for a third time but uh he's a charm so um yeah thank you uh so uh getting rid of uh you and you go away go away Thank you. Okay, um, that's nice to know. Uh, for the canal aesthetics, you could also use the decorative pavement for a more industrial canal look. A gravel, e a gravel erosion barrier or a concrete bank would probably look good. That's also a very good idea instead of the embankments. Um, I will fiddle uh, around with this, but I want to do that once this is done and once we have our first ship going because 
if it's not deep enough or if I have to make it wire, it's, it's a waste of time and effort uh, to really start decorating. Thank you. Uh, and Chuck says, regarding expanding the farm, uh, I've not tested this, but it seems logical to me that you should have the same number of tractors as you have combined. Also, the number of appeals should be a multiple of the number of trackers. tractors. That way, if you have 10 tractors, 10 combined, and 20 or 30 fields, the tractors all start and finish at approximately the same time, so the growth stage can be off and running. The same goes with the combines, all starting and finishing at approximately the same time for a faster, more efficient harvest. Well, my um, um, experience is that um, tractors are uh, the sowing goes quicker than the, the harvesting, and so therefore, uh, if I have this tractor, it's 34 kilometers an hour, and uh, this is the quickest harvester at 20. So this is the reason why I'm having uh, twice as much harvesters, I think, uh, for a 10. Yeah, uh, th th this is for a 16, 20. Yeah, I have 20 harvesters and 10 tractors uh, because th th the harvesting goes slower. But we can see that we, um, is it, let, let me see, 10 tractors. And how many fields do we have? Oh, how, how am I going to count this? Oh, shit. Uh, how do we do this? Um... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Uh, I don't know. 40? Sh shall we eyeball it? I think we have 40 now. So that's two per harvester. But we do have time left. So I do want to place extra fields. So maybe we can place some fields here and here. Closer to the city. And some fields like here. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I don't know this episode because how long am I in? Because I've been babbling 70 minutes already. And I want to have 20 minutes, uh, 30 minutes episode. So yeah, that's uh, uh, something to think about. Dilambus says, we could clearly see your affection for terrain tra transforming. I also share this. You told several times you play a lot of Satisfactory with Oliki's gang. Once it becomes boring, convince them to try Astroneer. That was also one of the options we had. It's a wonderful game and you uh, can't have more terrain tra train forming terrain train forming than in, in this game with a smile. I am definitely want to try Astroneer. Um, P.S. The moped ride would be even more funny in third person. Yes, you're right. That, that, that's what we need to do to, to do that in third person. Let's see if we can do that for a bit now. If anyone is leaving, no one is here. Okay, let's let's uh, see where you are. Oh, no. Nice. Right, right next door. Oh, you're entering here. Um, this is not going to be very easy. Where are you? Okay, let's zoom in here for a small right because probably how do you do that like so zoom in like so <laughs> well if you, if you are in this much of a hurry don't go the other way around oh here that is fun oh wait Zoom in. <laughs> so yeah, we do get it. Go away. Where are you? Here. And we're going back. We're going this way. This way. This way. Okay. That's the one for this fun. <laughs> and we get to see some of the city with our uh, radio station. Uh, and our foot pass, which, which, is, which is just stops in the middle of nowhere. And we're back at the, at the secret police here. We should upgrade the, these roads as well, actually. How about uh, doing that now, maybe? I think that would be a wise uh, thing to do. Uh, food, how much food do are we having? Mm, not a lot. Meat? Uh, we have enough, so yeah, we can upgrade these roads. Let's do that. Uh, 
do these ones quickly. Uh, I update you. You. Uh, you have a temporary foot pass here. Uh, you were, you were agreeing. Why? Okay, that you do have access, and then uh, assign the 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 crown corps gang here to do that, and probably have here a high priority. And then also upgrade. Well, I've, I've been wanting to do this for ages. You, probably you, also you, and uh, uh, have a higher priority here and here as well. Okay. Do we have? We ask uh, how do you call these bulldozers? Yes. Okay. So, and we also are going to need to do this here, but for that I need to change the lines first, uh, because I want uh, the people to, uh, during the upgrade, they have to be delivered here, or else, you know, power and stuff like this. Okay. Um, so, that was a fun little ride. Uh, thank you, Tlumpus, for the suggestion. Uh, Adam said, oh no, you... Demolish your, your, the pretty bridge. And then he said, oh, prettier bridge. Um, power lines looking way more nicer too. I thought so too. Um, and I, I'm, I'm, oh, the bridge is uh, finishing up. I'm almost done with the comments. And then we're going to crank up our, our heating. Uh, or do we, do we do that now? Because I think the heating plant is, will, or the, 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 the power plant will be done now. Yes. Oh, crap. I forgot the drinking water. I forgot the drinking water. Hmm. It will work without drinking water, right? And oil, but it's 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 not complaining. So yeah, my uh, so what well, my assumption was works. It it gets the oil from here, but it 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 won't pump the oil to there. So let's change uh, for um, this uh, this line and say. Don't go there, but go there. You can go away and you can get out. Okay. And then have the extra vehicles on the line, which are here. You. Uh, add and add and add. And uh, so now we are delivering to the power plant. Um, my my what my my cables are done so that means i have electricity here again right yeah because uh the vehicles are being uh busy again all right excellent so this is going to work i am having 15 workers yeah let's just wait a bit uh to see when this is going to and i need to address the the water and sewage because I do think it will work, but I think with less water the productivity will be less. So, I don't know how to do that, actually. To think about that. I think I do know. Maybe I can use this technical office and have a water and sewage station. Well, how could I... Could I... A water loading station. Can I... Uh, assign that to you. Yeah, the sewage. Can I assign that to you? Road connection with construction office does not exist. Don't you have a road connection here? But this isn't a construction office, by the way. No. Uh. Okay. Can I assign you now? Um, sewage discharge. Don't you have a road connection? Sewage heat heat exchange. Go away. Sewage loading and unloading station. No, you don't have a road connection. So, you do see that I can assign you, but no road connection. So we need a, a dis loading. 
Wandeling station. This is Wandeling station. So we need an Wandeling station here. For instance, here, pretty, pretty close to the road. Um, and I'm not going to do this with this garbage office, by the way. Because that doesn't make sense. There, there are garbage offices who are more in that area. Mm -hmm. And then... Um, I think we... Oh, do we do Cosmo Copic? Copic, I go home. So, uh, do I want to... Use this one here. Or yeah, I'm going to go the easy easy route here. No, I'm not going to do the easy route. I'm going to do the sewage pumping station. Uh, you can't fit here, obviously, here. Yeah, so, uh, like so. Because these are real dirt cheap. Okay, go like so. And then... Like so. Uh, uh. I don't know what that noise was, but uh, sewage in, now sewage out. You go and uh, go like this. And you can go like so. No, you can go straight, please. And uh, this one I want different. I want you in the middle. Because I always do that. Do Oh no, there are only two there. Okay, but then I want you there. Like so. Okay, build you, assign you to the to the construction gang here. You don't have electricity probably here. Don't you have ele you don't have electricity here? Uh no electricity here. Do I have? I need to build a substation as well. Damn it! I, I could have better built it somewhere here. I forgot the, about the substation. I think uh, all the plans. We are not going to do this episode. Why won't you go? Um. Because we are running out of time. Um, you can go away. And uh, what are you? You are. I can go. You have a road connection? That's weird. You can go away as well. Okay. Let's try this again. Sewage unloading station. So, sewage treatment loading unloading station. These are modded ones, I think. Road station, small. Well, this one. So, uh, can I kind of create it here or something? I think that makes sense. Just a small unknown station. Like so. Ah, I, I, I again forget to check for the... I again don't have... I'm not here or something today. Um... I'm getting better, I promise. Again. You. So here I have... Do we do it? Do we do you Like so? Or like so? I think I don't want the connection to be on the main road. That's, that's the, ma the main thing what I'm trying to accomplish here, like so. And then we have this sewage pump kind of thing. Uh, you. And then you can kind of pump like here. Okay, you have Now are you going? Okay, and then you can go.
Who there? Oh. Sometimes it works. Do it. Do it. Doing it twice. Okay. This sounds better to me. Excellent. You go and no construction officers have passed. Oh, because I didn't add a good path here. Do all. You. Okay, and then we're going to assign the um, uh, technical office here to do that, probably. Or maybe technical office here. You can also have water and sewage. So we move you from here. Uh, go away. Okay, let's see. What are we doing here? There's 13 people. Uh, we are producing nothing now. Uh, because it's December the 18th and I'm forgetting to turn off this one. So, if I turn you off. Like so. And I should have done this earlier. I know, I know, I know. 83, you see it happening? <laughs> um, um, so let's see uh, how this goes, power-wise. You, you are not producing anything, so this means this is working. You are out of fuel. That's not a very good thing, actually. Don't we have fuel here? No. Why not? Do we have fuel? Yes. So why are we out of fuel? First things first. Hold on. Pause. You're, you're on fuel. Pause for a cause, Oliki says. Um, so you are producing now. And also pretty good. So that's good. So this works. And now we have other stuff here. So um, why are you not getting fuel? Because you are busy. And you have, have we don't have enough cisterns. So if I replace you and you go work there for now. And then buy a new oil tank here. Oil tank. Water capacity. You. Okay. Because why are we out of fuel? Because there's too much to do. What I what? Oh yeah, go hurry up. Because if our buses run out of fuel, well, no, because you have fuel. That's that's not an issue. So, you can do do stuff, please. Okay, this is weird. Now, where are you loading your fuel? You're loading your fuel there. A bit even there. Okay, which fuel station? You do. Yeah. So, you don't have any fuel, so why won't you go do stuff? Oh, you're out of... Uh, <laughs> you're out of fuel. Well, you know where to get it. Or I don't know how. Why don't you refill? Play. Okay, what's the other one doing? You're getting fuel. Oh, you are going to a gas station. Okay, that that's uh, that's hopeful. Let's kind of follow this guy. Um, what I'm not seeing is that we're exporting power. By the way, I think 
maybe because we need to wait a bit because uh, all the all the wires have to fill up before we can export it's going down oh, we're exporting too how could i see that uh, can i instance see uh, I don't know. I don't know. Electricity problem. Okay. Forwarding pump. Are we not having electricity here? Ah, the, the power plant was in range of this pump. We are in luck. No, yeah, we are having... We are. Okay, let's kind of see if we have enough people working here. No, only five. So we need more... Buses here, probably. Because it's not enough. So what we are providing. We can have you. 12, please. 12. Only one is going to the power station. Yeah, this is, this is, this is not enough. Uh, luckily, we can kind of um, fix that um, by importing power. Let's set you to import and then uh, I think if we do it like this we are also exporting our imported power so that means I thought we were exporting power. Wait a minute, we were exporting power here, right? Apparently not. No. Okay. And now we're going to import power here. Okay, this should fix some of the electricity problems, hopefully. Let's see. It's being more steady. Yep. So, yeah, we're waiting for the refuel. Oh, are you kidding me? You are waiting for here? You can past it. You can get past it, you know. Now, go and do useful stuff. Well, this is a kind of a chicken and egg problem, right? Where are you? Okay, you are getting fuel. Let's kind of follow you. Because more buses are going to run out of fuel like this. Oh, I did it. I, I didn't click. I thought it going awfully. Okay, are you going to wait? No, thank you. Go, go. You don't have any sense of urgency, do you? <laughs> they are so polite, even when it's a, when it's an emergency. Okay. We are dropping in happiness. Loyalty's gone up a percent. gas station which one are you going this way all the way there okay um hurry up please because we are having more and more where are you here oh you're not waiting there are you thank you you need to upgrade these okay so we are going again anyway um now i want to see if i oh wait a minute how many people are working here now do we have a better uh number of people working here five i i need to uh address this 
We need to have more people. You know what? Um, we're going to do this the next episode. First thing first, because I'm in too long otherwise. Um, how long are we? 40 minutes, you see? Uh, because I've been babbling on and I haven't even read Adam's last comments. So I, had to, I have to do that. What do you plan on doing with the old hidden power plants? Some say old and polluting. Some say proud and historic monuments to the glory of the Republic. Uh, well, we might need them. I <laughs> mean, we might desperately need them. Um, because now we are, we have reverted to importing our, our power again. Which is not, uh, which is actually not the way uh, we want to do it. So, um, for now they are, uh, they are desperately needed, probably. Um, that to zero workers, they can become a site of historic record and nostalgia. Someday, if needed, some say they could be reactivated in times of great need, but only in an emergency. Oh, you are so right here. Um, glory to the Republic. Adam, thank you for your comment. And, um, um, next time we are going to... Address our power issues, um, our outages. Yes, and uh, luckily we can import uh, power. So um, I want to thank you for watching. We are almost at 4,500 people, which we were. I think we lost people because of my my excellent. Uh, let me see the population. See, we've lost people because of pollution again. Excellent. Okay. Well, let's let's hope we. we won't lose more people. These are done. So, and we are creating our water for there. Next time we are going to uh, add some more people to work there. I want to thank you for watching. Hopefully our happiness increases now. Uh, I want to thank you for watching. I hope you have a nice day and see you next time. Bye bye.